when you first see Darth Maul, he's a hooded character with his, you know, with his outer cloak on. We, we love that aspect. We love it where you can have it hood up, hood down. So we want to capture both those moments, give the collector the option to display them either way. What we wanted to get with this piece was a pose that sort of suggested that moment where he was contemplating kind of his wind up to, to go into battle. It was a little bit of a challenge finding Ray Park behind all this makeup that he had and the tattoos. In order to facilitate it in paint, I had to actually scribe in the tattoo. I don't even know how they did the makeup every day, to tell you the truth, because uh, just doing that one time in the sculpture was, was a bit of a challenge. To the casual observer, it seems like he's basically just dressed in all black, but there's layers of black and different fabrics and the cut. It really creates kind of a, a very three-dimensional costume. At this scale, we wanted to make it the most impressive lightsaber we could. When you turn it on, it just feels like a lightsaber. You expect it to hum because it's so bright, it's so consistent throughout the whole tube. It's one of the most exciting things, aside from the size, is just the detail and the attention that we're giving every little aspect of this is just amazing. 